This year, we have been blessed with some amazing VR headset releases, from Apple's Vision Pro to Meta's newest flagship Quest 3. It's really been a good year for VR fans, but the year is not yet over, and neither are the surprises. Ever so often, there is a headset that isn't just an upgrade on the old Meta, but something that makes us use the phrase game changer. And well, this bad boy might just be that. Meet the Varjo XR4. This headset might just redefine how we see virtual reality and what is possible in this ever-growing landscape. Excited? You should be. Whether you're a casual VR user or a diehard enthusiast, Varjo has been making waves in the VR scene for years. It's hard to believe you've never heard of them. Even though they have been mostly overlooked, because they mostly advertise and create headsets for big companies, there is a twist. The XR4 isn't just for big companies anymore. It's coming straight to consumers, and it's packing a punch, just as its predecessors. Now, here's a question for you. What if I told you the latest and greatest VR experience might be more affordable and accessible than ever before? As we said, Vario is largely known for enterprise-level headsets, as well as enterprise-level prices. But let's put that aside for a second and marvel at the beauty of XR4. This is a VR beast that's sleek, powerful, and half the price of its predecessor, the XR3. Don't get me wrong, that headset was no slouch, and you won't be disappointed with its performance if you get it under the Christmas tree. But the XR4 is here to steal the show. We're talking true 4K mini LED displays that are whopping 3,840 by 3,744 per eye, which currently makes it the highest resolution VR headset on the market, even higher than the Vision Pro. It also boasts 120 degrees field of view and a design that feels a bit oddly familiar. Just look at the side by side, it's hard to unsee it. Did I mention it's half the price? Yeah, that got my attention too. Varjo also decided to ditch the base station tracking for inside-out tracking. And guess what? Razer, yes, the one and only gaming equipment giant, is in on it. Inside tracking with Razer controllers is a move that might sound wild, but sometimes the unexpected turns out to be a genius move. And to be fair, this isn't Razer's first rodeo in creating VR controllers. Some years ago, they worked with Oculus on creating controllers for them. And if my memory serves me right, those bad boys performed pretty good. Now that almost a decade has passed, I have no doubt they did a pretty good job here too. But I do have to be honest that I might be a bit biased, given that I am using their keyboard, mouse, headset, and microphone. Don't don't judge me, okay? Now, coming back to the overall XR4 experience. The resolution is off the charts, the clearest VR image you've ever seen, and that isn't a small thing to claim. Reading small texts in VR has pretty much become a breeze. But here's the real kicker, the pass-through mixed reality. It's not quite reality, but it's close enough to mess with your mind. I found myself trying to grab virtual objects in the real world. The more you stay inside Varjo's reality, the more you start to lose the grip on ours. Honestly, those simulation theories are starting to look more and more probable. And you guessed it, that's not all. Here's where it gets mind-bending. Eye tracking meets pass-through cameras. Look at your hand, and the camera focuses on it. Look away, and it shifts. It's a feature you need to experience to believe. Don't get me wrong, some other high-end headsets do this too, but this one is so damned good at it. Unfortunately, the price tag on this version might make your wallet cry. Speaking of wallets, the XR4 isn't cheap. It will cost you a little less than $10,000. I know, it's insane. But there's a more affordable version sitting at around $4,000. Still hefty, but considering what it offers, it's a strong contender against other big players. Varjo is stepping into the ring with all the other contenders on the big market, and it's making the next few months in the VR world very interesting. In a nutshell, after spending some quality time with the XR4, it's a top-tier headset, especially for simulations. Is it for everyone? Probably not. But if you're into high-end VR experiences and have the budget, this might be your new VR king. So what are you waiting for? Dive into the future of VR with the Varjo XR4. Like, share, and subscribe for more VR adventures, and let us know in the comments. Would you splurge on the XR4? If you are interested in the best VR games to look forward to in 2024, make sure you check out this video. See you there!